Do you know why we're here? I guess I didn't know. No? We, they're going to take our pictures today here. My name is Fred Heaney, and uh, I've been with Elizabeth, will be 64 years in September. My wife Elizabeth is an artist, quite professional, and um, long ago I figured if I didn't go where she wanted to go, we wouldn't be going together. This is one reason that we have had such a glorious time together all these years. We still have our good times. Uh, not like they were, but quite different. We knew something was wrong long before it was diagnosed as such. The doctor tested her for memory and so forth. And I was looking through some Christmas cards and I saw in, where I wrote a letter in 2011, and I told people that Elizabeth had Alzheimer's. Our doctor had said to me, you should be looking for a place to Elizabeth to spend long term. And I says, no. I have nothing against these long term homes, but they're not home. I had always been a helpmate for Elizabeth. Uh, getting meals and so forth. I wasn't foreign to the kitchen. She still has a mind of her own, so it takes some uh, getting to get her up and, and to do things. And she can't really dress herself. She'd be putting her shirt on her feet. And if I asked Elizabeth to put something in the refrigerator, she doesn't know where the refrigerator is. It's just as liable to be in the oven or some other place. I have met a lot of caregivers over the years, but uh, Fred definitely stands out. He is the most patient and caring and kind person. The love that he has for Elizabeth is, is unconditional and it's, it's amazing. After all the years, he's, you know, he still calls her my love. Come on, my love. Let's go, my love. So, yeah, he's amazing. He deserves it, 100%. Well, I was quite flabbergasted. I didn't know uh, just what to, to make of the whole thing, deal. Uh, my family is quite uh, ecstatic about my achievement. But you might say, I don't understand why. I, I don't do anything that anybody else can't do. He told me once that he married her for, um, for better, for worse, and in sickness and health, and that he, he will stand by her no matter what. So. It's sometimes not easy when you're a caregiver, and, but um, ultimately the love prevails and it works. Thankfully, I'm still able to have Elizabeth home. She was always a kind, gentle, loving person. Always. <laughs>